Jethro, the priest of Midian and father-in-law of Moses, heard about God's blessings for Moses and his people Israel, including their escape from Egypt. After Moses had left his wife Zipporah, Jethro received her and her two sons, Gershom and Eliezer. They met in the wilderness, where Moses shared the good things God had done for Israel and the hardships they faced. Jethro was delighted to hear about the Lord's rescue of Israel from the hand of Pharaoh and Pharaoh, and praised the Lord for his actions against those who had treated Israel arrogantly. Moses brought a burnt offering and other sacrifices to God, and Aaron and the elders of Israel ate a meal with him in the presence of God. Moses served as judge for the people, and his father-in-law asked why he did this alone. Moses explained that the people come to him to seek God's will and bring disputes to him. He advised Moses to be the people's representative before God and teach them his decrees and instructions. He also suggested selecting capable men from all Israel to serve as officials over thousands, hundreds, fifty, and tens. Moses followed his father-in-law's advice and appointed capable men as leaders of the people, serving as judges at all times. The difficult cases were brought to Moses, while the simple ones were decided by them. Moses sent his father-in-law on his way, and Jethro returned to his own country.